Welcome once again to Anatomy and Physiology at Glen Oaks Community College. I'm Dr. Rem Hartong. For this video, we're going to look at where the heart is in the chest and then just a few parts of the heart. Um, this, of course, is a torso model from my lab. These are the organs inside the thoracic cavity. The heart is here between the right lung and the left lung. If I take out the lungs, you can see that the heart is almost, almost in the center of the chest. It's a bit towards the left. Um, and the point of the heart, or the apex of the heart, makes an angle. So you could say the heart sits in our chest at an angle so that the apex points down towards our left hip. That's the general positioning of the heart. In terms of size, this torso model's heart, compared to its size, is pretty much the size of the heart for a person who is this size. For a person, for a person who's my size, and I'm a bit larger than the torso model, the heart is truly the size, just about the size of your fist. So mine would be just a bit larger. Um, one of the neat things about this is when you watch people do the Pledge of Allegiance, um, they often put their hands up here, but really the, heart, the hands should be down here because that's really where the heart is. Another thing about the location of the heart, if I take this heart out, um, you can't see it in this model, but the spinal column is back here. It's being covered up by other organs right now. The spinal column's back here just behind the heart, and just in front of the heart, is the sternum. So the heart would lie, this is the left side of this chest, so the heart would lie just a little bit to the left of the sternum here. The reason I mention all of this, when you're doing CPR, when you're doing compressions on the sternum, you're actually squeezing the heart between the sternum and the spine, and that's what's helping to squish the heart and push the blood. So that's the basic size and location. Let's look at major features on the heart. If I open this heart up, I'll just show you the chambers. Right ventricle, left ventricle, right atrium, left atrium, right atrioventricular valve, also called the tricuspid valve, left atrioventricular valve, also called the bicuspid valve or mitral valve. Interesting thing in anatomy, things often have several names depending on when the names were come up with. Um, and I guess those are all the major parts that I wanted to show you right now. And again, that's where the heart is in the chest, inside of the body, and its relative size. Any questions, always feel free to let me know, and I'll answer them as best I can. Thank you again for watching.